<laughs> oh god. Cool. We're starting one minute into the video, but hey, what's going on, heroes and heroines? It is I, the fanatical Makai Vega, coming here today with another episode of the Caligula Effect. Said it right that time. Oh, yeah. I don't need friends, they disappoint me. Now, where we last left off, I had recently got my ass kicked by a good old sweet the pee. And. It's because I was stupid and I didn't like grind at all and I didn't even know that I could like switch out my main characters. As you can see here, I got Blaze Black, Mifui, and Katono in there along with a new new girl with you, Sato. I just found her on the street. She was like arguing about some girl that she liked or not liked. I don't I don't really know. I don't really pay attention to these kids' problems. But long story short, she's fighting for my side now, and we're all above level twenty and I think I'm ready to kick Sweet Pea's ass, and I can't officially get this episode started until we beat Sweet Pea, so let me just go through that right now. Go straight to the head. See if we can skip this now. Now. I can just skip this. <laughs> I guess I'm dumb. Whatever. Man, man, dragon, dandelion. All right. <clears throat> it's about to go down. Look at everybody jumping up in here. All these people got my back. So now we're ready to fight. Let's do it. So, um, yeah, we can do without all your, all your extra shit. <clears throat> this is gonna be the easiest goddamn boss battle <laughs> I ever do. <laughs> Cause we all have our goddamn finishers, so this is about to be over in a second. It's just a straight execution. Mortal Kombat. <clears throat> Boom. It's like that one like anime mode where everybody comes together and just like unleash their finishing moves on one dude. And he's just like, oh nani! This is dead! You're dead! You're just dead. Oh, and then it happens again. The same move. Except from random stranger girl. Oh, it's fine. Cause guess what? Crucifixion! Oh wait, that only did half her health. But oh well. It's fine. <laughs> Fatality! Flawless victory. Holy shite. And the random chick gets the MVP. I don't even know why I had her when I could have had like Kotaro or fucking. I, it's been a while, I forget. God damn. <clears throat> I'll never leave this world, even if it is all a sham. I can't survive anywhere else. The next time we meet, I'll turn you all into chapstore. <laughs> that's, that's a random reference. Isn't that from like an old cartoon? Chapstore. Crap, she ran away. We weren't able to determine Miu's whereabouts. I thought this plan was stupid from the start. Maybe we should switch presidents after all. Fuck you, Kotaro. You're getting kicked out of the fucking club next time. Cry. Oh. I don't know what I'm apologizing for, but please forgive me. I'm so sorry! <laughs> oh my god. It seems like she has a painful memory that she can't share with other people. The princesses? 
didn't do anything wrong, and yet I said some really terrible things to them. Hey, you! Cheer up! Oh, okay. Do you resent fat people? I don't think she resents fat people. Nah, don't, don't even, just let it all out. Let it all out. Do, do what? Thank you. I don't know why I get like that. <laughs> I'm sorry. This is a sad moment. I'm making it bad. Well, even though we were able to find the Anastanado musician, we're back to square one again. Hey, Kinsuke, do you know anything about the other musicians? Hmm, I don't know exactly where they are. Their leader is a girl named Thorn. She was always in a dimly lit area, so I could never tell where she was, she was, she was, she was, she was, she was. Waka, waka. Thorn. Hmm? What is it? Come here for a second. Who? Us? What's up? What's wrong? Look at this. It looks like Sweet Pea dropped it. It looks like a ticket stub for something. The story, 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 story. Waka, waka. It's cut off there, so I'm not sure. I'm not exactly sure. Is it a maybe? This could be the story of something, right? If Sweet Pea left it behind, it might be the clue to going after her. Should we take it and investigate? Yeah, let's make sure my food chan's work doesn't go to waste. <coughs> I apologize. But anyway, now that all that sadness is out the way, cue the intro! Oh, wait, wait, you're back already? Okay, my, my bad. I was lost in thought. <laughs> you're out? Oh, I forgot about her. <laughs> Kensuke K, how dare you make me chase a fake lead? Although that's not what I'm here to talk about. Hey, everyone, check this out. Based on a recent health report, there's been an increase in cases of he 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 is just stupid. An astral syndrome. Is this news from the real world? Yeah, I still don't quite get it, but this isn't the real world, right? So, I was wondering what was going on with my body. I'm going through like puberty and stuff and I'm bleeding out of places that I shouldn't bleed out of. And I don't have any sort of mom or anything to tell me what's going on. And I'm really freaking out right now. Oh my god, I'm freaking out. I don't know what's happening to my body. So I decided to look into it. The number of people suffering from... Has grown since the first case was reported six years ago in Japan. Those affected are presented in body, not in spirit. They are only able to perform the minimum required to survive. 
Those are affected are present in body, not spirit. Sorry, I had to burp. But revelation right now, I'm calling that we're those people. We're those people uh, that's like, they're just completely brain dead. So we're put in this world so we can like live again, but we don't know about what's happening in the real world because we're brain dead. They are unable to uh, concentrate on school or work causing a considerable hindrance to fully functioning in society. Various institutions and university hospitals conducted clinical trials using MRI scans and EEG tests to measure Results show that patients are awake, yet their brains are in a dreamlike state. No cause or cure has been discovered. Or maybe this place is the disease. And maybe it's all connecting our brains somehow. Okay. Long term leaves absence of from work and school by those suffering from the syndrome have been a have become a societal issue. It has been suggested that the longer one suffers from this, the more difficult it will be to return to a normal life. There are also reports of those afflicted who live alone, having accidents, and dying from starvation. Dying from starvation? Seriously? I looked at the bulletin board at Subaru's, and apparently Shinzuka Niroi has the same symptoms! I cracked the mystery, guys! And it's the same for us! So they're people trapped in this world, right? You're probably right. But it's been in the news since before I got trapped here. But I never expected it to become like that. You have to get home. Quickly. Kotono called me this, but I, I can't speak. Kotono told me this, but I didn't know people would die. I'm sure some would be happy to die during a dream. But not us. I thought this was a paradise where we never became adults, but I don't want to die never having accomplished anything. Hey, what happens if our physical bodies expire in the real world? You'll disappear from Mobius. I can't bring people in unless they have a soul. What? Which means we're all gonna die! <gasps> that everyone here is still alive? What a relief. Ah. Uh, we wanted this to be like <coughs> an amusement park so you could forget about the real world. Sorry, this is how it turned out. <laughs> we'll be in trouble if we stay here. I'm sorry about the current situation, but can I be a part of your group? Please, come on. I'm begging you. What? Whose fault is it that the musicians found out who we were? Hell no. It's your fault, Katora, because you told her, you piece of shit. <laughs> That's what I'm saying. You're jealous to get to the that. <laughs> Besides, it's up to the president to decide on new members. That's right. The reason why we know Sweet Pea's true identity is thanks to Nariko Senpai. Are you going to abandon the girl in trouble? Shh! Well, what do you think? I can't trust her. No, she's cool. Nariko's cool. She livens up the group. Yay! Thanks, everyone. I'm super grateful. Welcome, Naruke. I'm excited to work with you. We have my girls now. I look forward to working with you. <laughs> well, whatever happens, don't blame me. So, Sai, what's next? President, did you have Naruko look into the stub drop by Sweet Pea? Oh, yes, Naruko, do that for me, please. Would you please, would you please, sweet baby girl? Sweet baby cakes girl, Naruko. I'm gonna use next. Hmm, 
There are too many search results for a ticket and story. It doesn't narrow it down by much. I took a picture and tried reverse searching the image, but nothing popped up. What the heck? Yo, slice bitch. It's not my fault. It's a source material. I suppose the clues we have are too meager. Well, I'll just ask my followers on Gossip Air. Wait, if you put it up on the internet, sweet people will find out we're looking into it. I guess we'll have to investigate. President, let's split up and look and let's look for clues. Uh, Scooby and Shaggy, you go this way. Velma, you go by yourself. And Daphne, you come with me and still get kidnapped because you're a dumb bitch. Uh. <laughs> yes, and if anyone finds anything, make sure to tell everyone on wire. Then I'll go with the newbie. Now we go. If someone doesn't keep an eye on her, there's no telling what she would do. Jeez, so distrusting. So, would it be a movie or a play? Or oh, an art or photo exhibit. I feel like one of those could be called the story of, story of, story of my life. Something wicked, wicked. <laughs> Or maybe a game. I only got a glance of it though. Hey, talking about what it could be, couldn't be, what, could, could, and couldn't be, won't get us anywhere. Let's end this meeting. Watch out for Digi Heads, everyone. Let's do it. Let's see, we're we going back to the school. Alright, we're going to the Hanmachi Station. Uh, I got here. They didn't mention nothing about going to like a train station, so I, I, I'm kind of confused on why they decided to. <laughs> why I gotta venture all the way out here. Look at all those uh, kids just branching out from one. Were you all just like one person and they split off into like 17? What kind of superpower is this? Whatever it is, I want it. Anyway, am I by myself again? That's not cool. Alright, let's see where we gotta go. Up here, let's go. I'm just wandering around the street. Looking at stuff, looking for stuff to do, let's go. So many pictures of me, everybody loves her. I wish I could be that popular. But alas, I am a tomboy. Hey, will you die with me? That's just what the voice sounds like. Oh, it's her. No, wait. I remember her voice. You want to see Mew, don't you? Come with me. <laughs> That's Thorn, the leader of the uh, the, the, the gang. The, the Austin says, musicians. <clears throat> You're much more composed than that man. I know why you were invited to Mobius and what you wished for. You didn't think your dream would come true and that's why- Why did- why did it change her name to Thorn? She didn't introduce herself. Like, it was question marks because we didn't know she was, but then it changed to Thorn. But she didn't introduce herself, so like, why would we now know that her name is Thorn? But whatever. I knew it, so, yeah, whatever. That's why you wanted those around you to support you more. We'll support you, Mio and I. I am Thorn, leader of the Ostinano musicians. You're just being taken advantage of by Shogo Satake. You know that your attempts to go back to the real world has created the rift and has threatened the existence of Medius. Correct. Do you have the right? Why are you doing this? I won't pressure you with these kinds of questions. We just want you to know. Uh, we want it to be fair. You only see your second sentence and those of the Gohong Club before you destroy the dreams of others to travel down the path you desire. 
I want you to find out what it is correct. Yes, and none of musicians are the Go Home Club, Neo or Aria, and also the hearts of those who can only live in Mobius. I know why you and Shogo Satake want to return to the real world. I also know why the musicians and many others want to stay in Mobius. And after that, I pick up man of the musicians. <laughs> it's like her trying to yell. <laughs> that was that was her trying to yell. <laughs> and after that, I pick the man of the musicians. What about you? Oh. Why did you do that? Oh. <laughs> the answer is behind this door. If you have any doubts, pass through. If you believe that your decision is correct, even after only seeing one side of the story, then go back the way you came. I will not force you to choose either path. I am merely giving you the opportunity. The decision is yours alone to make. So if we go through, I this won't be. We can we can we can go through the door. And nothing's gonna happen, right? Because at this point, curiosity is killing the cat. Because I, I want to see what's through the door. So I'm go I'm going through the door. Your face is pale. Are you okay? I'm surprised you can see the paleness. I can see everyone through their parameters too. The face category is very pale. Is this the real me? Like the like the real one, or is we just or is she just fucking with us? Is Arya the same to you? As you? Yes, she is. That's not good. Are you able to deceive her? Right now, I'm stronger, so I can also apply my administrative authority of an area. Please. It's going to be a bit bright, so please be patient. Ah, my eyeballs! I, I, I would, which is what I would say if I didn't already have a glaring white light beaming at me from the left side of my face. <laughs> is that an AK-47? Yo, shadow knife. That looks like a dope anime. I'd watch that. So what's going on here? Is this like the studio that everyone has? It's like filled with like everybody's... Like little quirks, like I, I see like the cakes and stuff for sweet pea and other stuff for other people, I guess. A waiting room for musicians only that exists between the metaverses and Mebius. I made it so that the musicians can deepen their friendships with each other. <laughs> what do you mean about looking, about me looking pale? Okay, I'm a black man. If I look pale, it's the end of my days. It'd be faster if you saw yourself. Hold on a second. Oh, this is what I really look like. Oh god. Oh god, no. This is what I look like all brain dead and oh, in, the, in the real world. Look in the mirror. The fuck? The fuck? <laughs> Am I a vampire or a ghost? You become a mystery musician. Listen. In this farm, you should be able to progress without the musicians, nor the go home club, knowing who you truly are. If you desire to go against Mia and the musicians as the go home club president, then do as you wish in your usual form. 
Maybe if you wish to see into the souls of those who can only dwell in Mobius, then you should act as Lucid. Oh, is this like an infamous sort of deal where you can choose to be good or you can choose to be bad? Or in this case, choose to do whatever you think is right based on the own your own uh, morality issues and stuff. <laughs> I'm trying. I'm trying to sound smart, but it does, it's not working out. But I can. I can be lucid, or I can be the go home club president, which lucid looks way cooler. But I don't think I'll have teammates, so that would suck. Mia has prepared doors that only you can see throughout the city. If you pass through those doors, you can come to this waiting room as lucid at any time. This is actually dope. If you wish to return to the go-home club, then leave the room through the door you came through. You can return to where you were in your usual form. It might be better to make the decision to return to reality or not after seeing the perspective of both the go-home club and the musicians. No one will know your identity aside from the three of us. While you are lucid, I will not acknowledge you as the go home club president and you and will give you orders like the other musicians. Oh, yeah. When you're lucid, I'll be your partner instead of Aria. Dope. Wouldn't that be dope? That would be dope as three, really? <laughs> that would be dope AF, as all the kids say. You know, are you staring at my boobs? Stop staring at my boobs. <laughs> Mia, you're the target of the go home club. It'll be too dangerous, and yeah, I, I definitely saw him staring at your boobs. He's such a creepy pervert, but you do have really nice boobs. Okay. <coughs> I can just hide in their pocket like this. Hey, ya! <coughs> <coughs> So what do you think? I've been wanting to do this ever since I saw Arya doing it. Oh god, what did they do to my voice? I sound like a grown black man. Oh god. <laughs> oh god, no. See? It should be okay like this, so I... So can I. I suppose so. I'm counting on you, Lucid, but don't ever hand me over to the go-home club. I've never done desktop music before. I definitely have. I futz with Logic Pro all the time, so... You know, if I'm a musician, I need a song. That's right! Oh, wait, 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 wait here. <laughs> I might, yeah, I might go a little, a little country with their voice. That's right! Oh, wait, 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 right here. <laughs> Where Ari's like, wait, wait, right here. Wait, 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 right here. Maybe like this, uh, this is your equipment, uh, use it as you like. Make the most killer beat, make, make, make God's plan by Drake, I, I won't blame you, I won't tell him you stole it from the real world. Now release your emotions, I'll say the lyrics in your heart and sing them for you. This is, this is dope, this is the dopest beat I've ever heard. Amazing! Amazing! <laughs> it is, Linden. It seems what I saw on you was correct. This kind of... Might be a little bit too much, though. Honestly. Okay, okay. So, I, I do want to get out of here. But look at all the upsides of being lucid. I get my own boss battle music. What, what, what else could you want? Okay, like what, like, like the upsides, like, cause if I go back to the real world and I'm all brain dead and stuff like that and I can't even do anything, I can't even talk, I can't, I can only just listen, like look there like I'm, and I can't do anything, but here, I can be somebody's boss battle, and like, <laughs> especially if I could be like the final boss, lucid, the final boss, doesn't that sound dope to you guys, come on, yeah, yes, it's so amazing. I'm gonna practice singing this. What? I don't. I can't imagine any sort of lyrics you can put to this song. 
I already forgot the, uh, what voice I gave her. Ah, oh, whatever, whatever deep voice. Thank you, Lucian. Let's make Mobius wonderful together. Ah, yes, this is Patrick Stewart. How are you enjoying the program so far? <laughs> oh, well. So that just happened. Lucid has his own music and he's super dope. And he's everything that I wanted to be. He looks cool. I don't look cool. Look at this. I I don't look cool. I don't I don't have pants. I wear like purple socks that don't go with any of the rest of my clothing. It doesn't even go with the flower on my freaking shirt. And like my skirt is like bigger than everyone else's. Look at that. Why is my skirt so so much bigger than yours? And it's grayer. It looks weird. Oh, it's AG. What's up? What's up, man? Hey! You really? Okay, wait, wait, wait. Actually, what kind of voice should I give him? Hi! You were the one with Satake kun and Kotana kun san. Do you need something from me? Uh. Another thing about this ticket stuff, bro? Hmm. It looks like uh, ticket stuff or something. Why don't you go to the gift card shop? They might be selling the same ticket. Looks like you don't know where it is. Uh, God, you're so useless. Oh, yeah. Why did you ask about the Go Home Club? You guys are the Go Home Club, right? I saw your picture online recently. I want to go back to the real world as well. I've been looking for the Go Home Club. And don't worry about my voice. I know it sounds like a dumb surfer dude voice, but I'm actually really intelligent. I use big words like intelligent. The reason you hide your identity is because there are people trying to get in your way, right? Then I can help you. Not to brag or anything, but I'm pretty good at negotiating. I think it'd be more useful than Satake King. Which one's Satake? I get my Japanese names mixed up. That's the dude, right? Oh, there are two dudes? Three dudes! Oh, God. Whichever Satake one. I'm sure it's the one with the black hair. Why don't you think about it? He seems to be avoiding me anyway. <clears throat> you don't know where the store is, do you? I'll show you where it is. Here we are. It's a bit hard to find. So I don't blame you for not knowing. It's not a big deal, so don't worry about it. I'm actually pretty good at assisting others. In how many ways? Oh, where the frick did you come from? Huh? President? In Biwasaka? Hello, katona sa What happened? Oh yeah, Katona's on Biwasaka's dick. I remember that she, I think he has a crush on him. She might like him, that's why she's all smiley and stuff like that. Oh, so that's what happened. I also thought that maybe coming here would help us find out. I should have expected it from you, Katona. It seems that you're not only beautiful, but you're also super smart and intelligent, like me, who uses big words like intelligent to show off his intelligence. Jeez, you're making such a big deal out of this. It just sounds like you're mocking. Are you mocking me, Bidusaka? <laughs> Don't play with me, haven't you? Uh, of course not. Now, ladies first. He's such a gentleman. Hiroshai, my son! Welcome to my shop! What can I get you? I have advanced tickets, discount tickets, coupons, and complimentary tickets! Hold this unbeatable price! <laughs> Sorry, I sometimes I talk without breathing because I forget to do that sometimes! <laughs> I'm a very energetic street clerk. This. This uh, world is very strange. All of the adults here are fake, and the real people are all children. What's so great about children? Hello, good afternoon. I know my voice is sort of different from how I was doing two seconds ago, but the fucking energetic stork leg bros kind of took over <laughs> for a second, I just forgot. <laughs> I'm sorry. Um, We're looking for a ticket like this? Do you have one like it here? Let me see. Hi, 
I've seen this before. He should be. Oh, here it is. Here it is. Here it is. The story of Miyava Hot Springs. A hot spring? Yes! It's a hot spring! Theme park in the city! When the natural hot springs, water is pumped from deep! I I think this the storekeeper died. Um I I think he forgot to breathe again. St shopkeeper, are you are you, are you okay? He's pumping deep on the ground! I'm sorry. The management company is the same as Sebra's house. You can enjoy many pairs and hot tubes there. It's particularly popular with the women. <gasps> Just like you! Sebra, I say. <laughs> of course, the cool and bass in particular. Oh, who oh, to be so young? I'm jealous. <laughs> so it's a shareholder complimentary ticket. The design is different from the general ticket, so even if you've been there before, nobody would realize this. Do you know a lot about this, Biwasaka King? Actually, I'm the CEO of an IT venture company, as we do this as well. CEO? It's normal to give preferential treatment and company discounts to shareholders for fundraising purposes. <laughs> it's good to have big dreams! So, will you be purchasing it? Fuck. My game capture just fell. My capture card just fell. Hold on. Hold on. I gotta make sure everything's still good. Now we're good. He brought something. No one's ever brought something here before. <coughs> God, energetic store clerk is exhausting. I'm glad he was a side character and will never be seen of again in the story. President, let's ask Biwasaka King to join the Gahan Club team. Really? We were to find out which ticket it was thanks to Miyusaka King. And you're a CEO, right? If an adult were with us, I think it'd be great help. Oh, so, like, I guess he's actually an old man in the real world. I guess we're not all the actual age of, like, what we are in the real world. So, like, he could be, like, 49, I could be, like, 78. But, like, in this world, no matter what age we are, in the real world, we're like 17 forever. Okay. Okay, I'm sorry. I'm starting to get what's going on. I'm, I'm picking up what you're putting down. Wow. Thanks. I need to hurry up and get back to my employees, too. It's my job to protect the lives of my employees and their families. I wonder how they're doing. Families. That must be tough. I'll ask everyone to gather via wire. We know what, where we need to go next. So let's have everyone meet here. Dope. But little did they know, I'm actually the mystery musician known as Lucid, and I'm plotting to betray them all. <laughs> So that's the situation. I'm, I'm putting, I'm adding a little bit like more British tinge to her voice, just so I can differentiate it more. Ah, so it was there. I've been checking out popular faces, but I totally thought that it was a movie or something. You were checking cafes and crepe shops. You 
barely did any investigating. I'm Patrick Warburton. What's happening? Peter. <laughs> Shh. Don't be a tattletale. Don't you dare. Oh, wait. Wrong voice. Don't you dare tell me what not to be. Ah, Peter. <laughs> Does that mean that sweet piece on often goes there? She did have shareholder benefits, so that's a likely possibility. Even if she got it easily through being resourceful, there's a good chance she frequents that place. Then let's go to the bathhouse and capture sweet peas. I also want to see some naked boobies, so let's go to the co-ed bath so I can see some good vagina. I've never seen that before. What? No, I've totally seen vagina before. What should we? What should we do about Biwasaka Senpai? I'm all for it, but there's nobody who objects to it, is there? <coughs> There's a, there's a lot of voices I gotta do. You gotta give me a second to remember, to remember what his voice was. <laughs> Even though I was just talking to him literally two seconds ago. Um, I owe you one, Mifuicha. Mm, this bitch. He's a hard worker who found a clue, 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 clue. Wicka, wicka. I'm for it. I'm not opposed to having more people. He's a CEO, right? And you're the one who's gonna be the follower, right? Scaredy cat. Ah, Peter. <laughs> Sorry, I've been watching Game Grumps lately, and that's how they think that uh, Joe from Family Guy's actually. He just constantly goes, ah, Peter. <laughs> oh well. What? I was here first, though. Doesn't matter if he was a CEO. I also am for it. I, I, I also am for it. Um, please take into account my voice. Why did you say to do that? I can't hear you. You're talking too low. I said I'm also okay for being a suck again. What? <laughs> I did. Me too. <laughs> oh. <laughs> okay. What should we do? I don't care. <laughs> why, would, why would I ever deny these people? And I feel like if I did, they would just join anyway, you know what I mean? My, my decision would just get overrided, like with the thing with uh, Kotono last time, and where they made Mifu be the tea party person. Yeah, I feel like this is that kind of game where it like, gives you the false sense of choice, but it really makes you do the same thing. Uh. Well, now that our identity's been discovered, it might be better for us to have more numbers. And I can't wait to see all of your uh, forms, your Caligula effect forms. I, don't, I still don't know where the Caligula effect comes into it, because it's definitely called something else effect. Yeah, whatever, I'll remember it later. Looking forward to working with you, Bibasaka. I look forward to working with you too, Satake King. And with the rest of you as well. I'm excited to work with you. What? Let's work together, Mr. CEO. Welcome to the club, Biwasaka King. It's not. Can't wait to partner with you. Welcome. Welcome. Let's work together. Okay. Now then, let's go to that hot spring theme park. Dope. Okay, I guess we're actually getting to the meat of it now, the big chunky chunk of it. I didn't care if I'd be able to get to a boss battle by the end of this one because uh, it's a lot of it's a lot of exposition here between those between between those two. I'm gonna go ahead and save save now that I get a chance. Hey, let's, let's say something. President, can we talk? I have a problem. 
I feel like someone's been watching me lately. It's creepy. Must be hard being so popular. Wait, is that a ghost? G -g 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 ghost? What -ga, what -ga? Sorry, I've been talking to Kaji B lately. <laughs> Come on. This is no time for jokes. I'm worried. I only, f only feel these eyes on me when I'm alone. Maybe I'm being targeted by someone. Maybe you're being targeted by Lucy, the mystery musician. Do you think a did he answer after you? Can you think of anyone it might be? No. Maybe I'm overthinking it. Nothing's actually happened to me. I'm just really creeped out. Anyway, I just want to make you aware of the situation. See you later. Okay. Character scenario? What the fuck is that? What is that? Can I talk to you again? Oh, look at doctor again. President, could you take a look at this? I'm always watching from your bridge. This was in my shoe locker at scale. What do you think? It's a threat. I should look at that. It could be, I guess, but they're not demanding anything, so it's useless as a threat. What is this person trying to do? He's trying to let you know that he's watching you. Are you too dumb? This is clearly a stalker. That's, what, that's why I say it's a threat. What are you talking about? Don't say that. Probably, probably some, probably some gloomy guy who got rejected by you and now he's trying to destroy you psychologically. Waiting for the... I told you to stop. <laughs> what if that's the case? What are you going to do? Oh wait, what are you going to do? Oh god. Let's, uh, let's catch them. <laughs> like, this could affect my go home club duties. So, plus, it's creepy as hell. Come on, President, lend me a hand. Uh, sure, sure, why not? I'm, I'm not okay with stalkers. Good for you, President. No, that's that. Let's go punch a stalker. <laughs> Thank you so much. I'm counting on you. But we'll need more information than just this letter. Ah, uh, you're right, sneaky stalker. I'll knock your lights out when I find you. If I find anything out, I'll tell you immediately. I feel a little safer because of the TV. Thanks. Okay. So. Will I just. Okay. It's supposed to be like a thing with everybody. Let me see how, how uh, Mifu is doing after that whole blow up she had a second. That's not Mifu. Um, Senpai, do you have time to talk right now? I have a problem. I definitely didn't talk. That's that's Mifu, right? That's, you can't see where I'm pointing, but that's that's Mifu who I'm looking at right now. I no one talked to you, Suzuna. I don't I don't know why you're intruding. Like I came to talk to you, but whatever. What's wrong, Suzuna? Did Katara bully you? I'll beat him up for you. I'll kick his ass. I'll stuff his big dumb brain into his big fat ass. No, um, it's about Mifu-chan. Don't you think she's been acting weird since Papuka? Um, guys, I'm right here. <laughs> I'm like literally standing right in front of you. You're looking me dead in the eye as you're talking about me. So can you like stop? <laughs> I keep wiping my face. My allergies are kicking them. It's still, yeah. Oh yeah, she was pretty moody. One moment annoyed, the next crying. Maybe she keeps going somewhere by herself after the girl home club disperses. Saying she has something to do. The guy asks her not to run on. She always says it's nothing. Hey, Senpai, I feel like Mifu is worried about something. Could you help her out? Let's leave her be. Alright, I'll keep it in mind. Let's do it. Thank you very much. 
Also, guys, I, I heard, like, all of that. So, you know, please don't, like, feel the need to watch me or anything. I'm just doing my own thing. So, can you can you just not pretend like I'm not here? Yeah, you're you're right, Susuna. She's definitely been acting really weird lately. I guess I'll keep an eye on her. Like, this, I just told you that I don't want you to do that. Thank you so much, Senpai. You're the best. I wasn't able to... But I bet you'd be able to help me finish him. Please do what you can. I'm still, like, right here. Like, come on, guys. What the fuck? <laughs> oh, of course. You're so sweet, Suzuna. It makes you feel warm and fuzzy inside. Ah, oh, well, brother, it's up to you. Worry about me for your squad. Roll out. Okay. Are you actually going somewhere this time? No? Okay. Can we talk to her once more? Uh, would that fuck with her too much? Hey, Sunflower! <laughs> ah, yes! This is Sunflower? How may I help you? Oh, oh, gee, Senpai. What, what do you need me to do? Are you okay? You were spacing out there. Nothing's wrong. I'm fine. I'm gonna excuse myself now because I have something else to do. She's still right there. <laughs> they couldn't at least animate her leaving or something. I don't. I don't know. It's just a little something. At least have her disappear. I. I don't care. She's like still standing right there. I'm looking her dead in her face, like leaning like this. Where'd you have to go, Mifui? Huh? You didn't seem to go anywhere. Um. It's just a Suzuna set. Anyway, you look at it. She's acting a bit off. Follow Mifui. Okay. I. I did. I didn't follow her. I'm still standing right in front of her. What are you talking about? It's a lotus ring. How am I supposed to follow her during a lotus ring? So what the frick does all this mean? It's... okay. This is random. <laughs> Way to be incognito, guys. Standing completely out of sight. Where no one can see you following them or anything. You know? Like, five feet away from her. Like, all she has to do is just... Hey, President! Why are you following me? Stop, you creepy bitch. It's been like five minutes now. What's she doing staring at the cafe? So strange. She's hungry. She misses food. Oh, wow. That Omaris looks so good. That Napolitan, too. What the? That's some monologue. She seems really hungry. Maybe she doesn't have any money? You should treat her. My voice is cracked. <laughs> what? Senpai, why are you here? We just happened to stop by. We weren't following you or anything. We decided to say hello because you were acting funny. President Straight, oh, why don't we have a lunch together? I want to eat armor stew. Ooh. I, I, I don't want anything to eat, actually. Huh? But you were practically about to eat your fingers. I was not. And what, what, what you doing? No. <laughs> oh, because you just sucked up. <clears throat> I don't want meat or whipped cream or chocolate cornets or greasy extra large ramen. I don't want any of it. She's trying to get her over her, like, uh, her eating. She has an eating disorder in real life. Mayfoy! Mayfoy! She's gone. What's going on? Yeah, she's just trying to, like, kick her eating, uh, disorder in the real world, but she's, like, she's just, like, licking it, I guess, through, or tasting it through, like, other people doing, there's some weird thing people do to, to get over things. I don't care if it really works in real life, but, um, so, I'm, I'm, like, done with this. I'm gonna leave. 
I'll, I'll talk to people later. Outside the school or inside the school? Outside the school. Let's see what's happening outside the school. Let's go. Let's go to the hot springs. This is pretty far away, but let's go. Let's continue on with the story. I'll, I'll talk to those people another time. See what they're... Okay. This... This needs to stop. All right. Put in 3D characters on a on an obviously 2D picture. But whatever this song is, it's fucking going ham. I can't wait to to fight the next Elsa not a musician to this song. Stop. Whoever 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 made the soundtrack to this song, who, whoever I put made the soundtrack in the opening credits, you did you did a good you did a good job. You did a great job. <laughs> your party has been dismissed. Please add members to your party from the main menu. Oh, okay. Look at me. Look at me. I look kind of dope there, honestly. I look kind of cool. Sugar looks. These are all the best pictures of everyone. They all look like kings. They all look like kings sitting their throne. Oh, and Katono, Mifu looking so cute. Oh yeah, we we still got people that we don't have. We we need to get Shizuna up in here. We need to get Biwasaka up in here. We need to get who else? Is that it? Is that everybody? That's probably everybody. All right, so let's see. Who should we equip, guys? Who should we equip? Dang, son. Katara actually looks like a beast. But I feel like we gotta let Mifui chill out this time. So I'm gonna go with Kinsuke, because I never really got to uh, see what he's about. So, how do I equip people again? I apologize, it's been a winner. Give me a second to figure this out. Change part, there it is. <laughs> Katana's always dope. And then we're gonna go with Shogo. This song is killing it though. I don't know what like instrument that is, where that's like a some somebody like playing with a harp or something like that, but like Cause it doesn't quite sound like a piano. It sounds like a harpsichord or something. Ooh, this is nice. Wow! Oh! Naruka. Naruka, yeah. She's also in her squad. I forgot about it. Wow! It looks like a festival! <clears throat> it seems that the business model's theme is a throwback to the Edo period. It's very realistic. I had no idea. How in the world do you make this meal? Wow, this place is so photogenic. Just as we heard, there are many female guests here. Oh, right. Let's ride. Splat. What's with this out of place music? I know, it sounds like a boss battle music, but we're just chilling. This music is Stork's. Uh, another musician. His was more popular with the ladies than mine. His name Stork P? No? No P after his name, like the first two? It's just like Kaji P, then Sweet P, then the Stork P. Stork P! Storks P! If Storks music is playing, then there's a good chance he's also here. The musicians have something akin to territories. They've been ordered by Thorn to constantly play the songs they wrote for Mew. To increase Mew's followers. Yes. Yes. Yes, you know, whatever. It's not as effective as mind phones, but if you hear the same song all the time, you won't be able to get it out of your head. I'm digging this one. So, Kaji P's song is like the main song, the one that I'm using in the credits. That's the one in the school. Okay, okay. It's like that song about never giving you up. Never gonna give you up. Never gonna let you down. It's what they call imprinting. Having people constantly around the same information gets it ingrained in their heads. Cause like I'm super smart with my big intelligent mind. I say like super smart words like 
Information. That's a big four syllable word. Information. Four syllables. That means I'm smart. It's a traditional tool often used in ads industry. A classic theory and very effective. Perfect. Even if Sweet Pea isn't here, we can at least capture that stork guy. Alright then. Let's look for the musicians. God damn, so many voices. So many different voices back to back that hurts my voice. Anyway, let's uh let's go do some stuff. Let's go go whoop some musician ass while jamming out to this very musician y music. So it's good. Yo, what's going on, E me? What's going on? Amy, I knew a girl named Amy once. You, that girl was talking about you. Who? I'll fuck her up. I'm very suspicious by nature. I don't know anything about you, so I had my guard up. Oh, I've heard this before. Okay. That is nothing. I don't know why I would, like, even talk to these people. Because I can just equip my own party members. So, like, I don't have to talk to these guys. Because my own party members are way stronger than any rando that I meet. So, what's, like, even the point of trying to, like, raise them up? <gasps> Stone Sabbath's songs are so mellow, yet sweet and sorrowful. Just listening to this song makes me feel like Stone Sabbath's always watching over us. Really makes you feel like that? The feeling keeps undressing you one piece of clothing at a time until your soul is naked and bare, so irresistible. Oh, God. I'm getting the same feelings, actually. I just want to strip my clothes off, and I'm not, I'm not going to do that to you. I've already showed my naked ass on camera. <laughs> I don't know how many of you have seen that video, but I, I've, I've done that. <clears throat> I won't tell you exactly which video that, I'll, that is. That way, you have to scroll through like every single one of my videos until you find the one where I show my bare naked ass. But I promise you it's there. <laughs> yeah, exactly. I'm sure he's quite the technician in the bedroom. He must be so handsome. He must be on the world's most bangable mitt. <laughs> oh god, I'm sorry. I'm sorry, guys. I'm sorry. Oh god. Oh god. I was just taken too far back by the oh god, the, the lack of innocence in these girls. Goodness. Look at Kotaro. Eh? I'm getting chills. See. That song? Is it really that good? Sounds pretty girly to me for a man to be talking about love and infatuation. Whatever, you just don't know women. Hey, you, you big oaf. How dare you fall with Stork Sama's music? Yeah! If you can't see what's truly great about this sound, you maybe you need to check the blood flow of your big head. They just have constantly changing voices, that's the thing. What? So what if it's big? <laughs> and so what if I got a big head and a little penis? It does just shouldn't matter. It should be about the size of my heart. <laughs> so what if it's big? <laughs> maybe that's all you have to brag about. Didn't you know that it's basically the same thing as walking around with the words I'm an idiot stuck on your forehead? Oh, I guess you didn't know since there's no death flow to that big head of yours. Ha <laughs> Too funny! You lip flapping big! Are you friends with this idiot? Are you the same as him? And you fail to understand the greatness of Stork Summer's music? Stork Summer's pretty dope. I, I like the song, so I'm, 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 I'm be real. Stork Summer's the best. He's the best. He's the, this is honestly the best song I've heard so far in this game. It's even better than my own theme music. If I had to choose, I would choose Stork's song over um, the song of the mystery musician. You see. <laughs> Even though he's nowhere to be found. No one, no one knows who his real face is. No one. No one at all in the world ever. Especially not me. The president of the Go Home Club. I'm not your greatest enemy. Not yet. Right? Right? He's the best. 
Oh god, I agree so much. It's making me shiver. Okay, skip all this bullshit. <laughs> so they get brainwashed, then become digiheads. Turning into a zombie might be more preferable. Just let them shiver. Hey, there's no way you can out talk a girl. Come on, Kotaro Senpai, let's go. Damn it! I won't forget this. Hey, when if something happens, I won't not help you. <laughs> what? I won't not help you. Is that what you're saying? Is that what you're trying to tell me right now? You won't not help me? Hey, look, a lady. I'm gonna take this thing first, and I'm gonna see. How you doing? You doing all right? Staring out into the to the sunset. They did great work in the in the background. This place definitely. Look at that big wall up there. So what? Oh, hey. Okay, I wasn't expecting that. But oh well. Let me. There it is. I'm the counter person. I've got to get this filled with beauty. Float into the air and smash down on the enemy. Guards against attack. Okay. That's a, that's a great move, actually. Alright. And then you two just fuck him up. Good lord! Look at him with that claymore! <laughs> Ooh, go clouds bust your sword ass having. Oh! You might be one of my favorite, Kinsuke. Is that his name, Kinsuke? Hey, hey, hey! Mr. Kari, hey, hey! Oh god! He's gay! Oh god! <laughs> oh god! Oh god! With the epicness. Just in case. Just in case I'm gonna keep doing stuff. Just in case I'm gonna. That was a tough battle. That was a tough one right there. That was fun. I got. I think that's my first time getting to see what King's gay can like really do. So he can like block attacks and counter them. And he can also just do that freaking swirly attack. Where he just jumps up in the air and just fucks him up. Fair. You guys finish him off. Kill him. There we go. There we go. I knew I could count on you, my best friends in the whole wide world. That I'm not secretly betraying as a member of the Ostinato musicians known as Lucid. <laughs> I didn't say anything. I said nothing. Don't look at me like that, Kotono. I didn't say anything. <laughs> so, let me get this straight. Uh, you're asking me if I've seen any musicians? I wanted to ask you that. I want to see Stork. <clears throat> ah! That's a... That's another man dressed as a lady, like from the other place. You remember that guy? That guy was weird. This is the same, same, same person. Look at that. He's got the same face and everything, just different color hair slightly. They call it palette switching. Remember? Remember when I told you that? So this one's just another rabbit fan. Kotaro Senpai. Yes. <coughs> mm. Now that you've mentioned it. Sweet Bee and the Flower Princess apparently frequent the baking soda fountain, something like that, maybe. Baking soda fountain? It's an alkaline hot spring. It'll wash away any fat and secretion, leaving your skin smooth and squeaky clean, squeaky squeaky skin. Shizuka Nijoing with clean and smooth skin? <clears throat> Let's not go there. Her heart is that of a young girl, much more than me. 
How are you, Katana, in real life? Just drop it. Drop drop the beans right now. What are you talking about? It doesn't have to be Stark. As long as it's a musician, right? Let's go to that baking soda fountain. Let's get that baking soda fountain. My voice, my voice over there always like starts off high and gets a little lower. That's just how it be. Anyway, let's see what we get. Let's see what's going on here. What's uh what's going on, Kazuhiko? You're level eight. I don't even want to talk to you. Why would I want to talk to you, old level one ass Yoko? All y'all are lesser than me because I'm level twenty five. Uh huh. All y'all can eat my boots. Even you, lost soul. Look at you. Look at you. You're level 20 in your brown armor. I'm gonna beat you up, okay? I'm the biggest dog in the park. Oh, wait. There's a, th there's a second person. Oh, God. We can't bully this person. Let's get this, let's get this one over here first. <laughs> Smack. Are we getting a loss in frame rate right now? Is that what this is? Oh no! Kinsuke, no! Oh, nice guard, Kinsuke! Shoot her! Shoot her to death! Ho 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 ho! Ho 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 ho! We're the best! We're the best! The go home club has to offer. I wonder if my powers change when I'm lucid. I want to be lucid so bad. <laughs> oh god. Oh, how's it going, lady? You want the smackage too? Oh my god! I wasn't expecting to like one one turn that oh and there's the next culprit just sitting there waiting for me to punk his ass up what are you just looking at me like that for you punk bitch you think that has any effect on me i have something that can pierce through your shield and make you go hanani ho go 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 one shot it they got no chance see i'm just too op I'm just too OP with all my bros and all this drop in frame rates. It's freaking dope. I'm the freaking dopest at like this thing and any other thing that you want to put in my face. Where am I going? This way? Alright, cool. Let's go this way. Who's, who's ever hitting the guitar solo right now? You're going ham. I'd like to give you my props. As a fellow Ostinato musician, don't tell the rest of the Go Home Club that, but I'm also an, a musician in my own right. I've created music, so, you know, if you ever want to collaborate or anything like that, just call me up, hit me on my cell, or just call my agent. He'll probably talk to you, too, and just lead you straight to me, so, you know, whatever. But don't, I'm definitely not an Ostinato musician secretly named Lucid. I don't know what you're talking about. I'm just a girl who is also the president of the Go Home Club. Okay. Put two uh, safe points weirdly close together, but oh well. We got it this way. Yeah, this is there's been there's a little bit of a drop in frame right here. I don't know what's going on. <laughs> Did you all make a level that was too big for your own britches? Let's see. Let's go this way. Sakura. What's going on over here? The baking soda fountain. The door is locked by the power of the words. World reward phonophobia. Okay, so I can. So okay, I think that's one of the uh, like quest things that you can do for like random people. Is like people when you're like befriending people like this. If you talk to them enough, they'll like tell you about their fears or their problems, and like it'll be something like phonophobia. And then you have to do their quest in order to unlock their like full potential or whatever the freak. But I, I'm guessing you have to do that to get into these doors, like these like specific doors. But I ain't got time for that, <laughs> so I'm not gonna do that. Cause I'm sure it's nothing, no, nothing I really need. And if it's something that'll make the game easier, I don't even want it, cause I'm already too OP as it is. You see, when we defeated Sweet Pea earlier in the episode, that took like two seconds. Two seconds, one turn, one move. The Ostin Island positions are nothing to me. That's why I will infiltrate their ranks and I will become one of them and then I will be their leader because I will be the strongest. But don't tell the Go Home Club that. 
<clears throat> I think I think Shaga has a problem with negative people. Which uh, should we go into? What should we do? What are you guys talking about? Isn't it this one? It's a difficult problem. All right, right here. I'll go look. Oh, he's going to the men's. I thought he was going to go in the latest one. I would have thrown us off. <laughs> she wasn't in the men's bath. Really, Kotaro? She wasn't in the men's bathroom. I'm not going to say anything. I'm just going to let let your words speak for itself. I'm just going to let that sentence speak for itself. Oh, jeez. We also have females. Oh, that's cool. Ha 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 ha. I picked the girl so I can go in the ladies' restroom. Maybe I'll see some a little bit of side boob action. <laughs> a little bit of side boob. A little bit of side boob like Arya Stark from the newest episode of Game of Thrones. Spoiler alert! Arya Stark side boob! <gasps> <clears throat> I guess surely us girls can go. Yeah. All of the girls. Yeah, all the ish girls. There's no choice. Uh, let's go, girls. Uh, yes, of course. Do we have to take off our glass? This is getting interesting. We'll be waiting here. But don't put yourselves too far. If they're here, just chase them out of the bath. Understood. Let's go, President. We could uh, peek some time in the ladies' room. <laughs> I can't really see well with the steam. I guess we have to go in and get naked. There's nothing we can do. Huh? Wait! Yo! Oh, Katona got nude. <clears throat> Whoa. You're so bold. She's wearing a towel. We're girls. This is this is a girl's bath. You never been in a girl's bath, huh? You never you never you never been in the in a public public bathhouse, huh? You never you ever just got nude in front of a bunch of other girls? Huh? You never do never do that? If sweet pea son really is here, what are you gonna do? We're gonna fight him butt guy has naked. That's what we're gonna do. We're gonna have a full naked orgy fight. That's what we're gonna do. She may look like a girl. Oh, she may look like a girl, but on the inside, she sees like a ninja. Well, we can't go in with our clothes on. It's not a big deal. Come on, the rest of you too. What? What? <laughs> what? <laughs> what? I don't even care. I'm not gonna say what because you know it's fine. I do this. I do this type of thing all the time. I get naked in front of girls. This is the thing I do. Is that Katona? It looks like Katona. <gasps> it's her. Even if there are weird machine-like people here, there aren't any barbaric squalling men here. This is paradise. They called me a greasy, fatty man. I won't ever forgive them. Jeez, why do men exist? Why are men a thing? Oh, she's so cute. Uh, I hate men. I'm gonna tell them to be lesbos with this purple haired chick next to me. We hate men. Men aren't so bad. What? Did I hear? Did you just hear each other's thoughts? <laughs> What's going on here? She's a man. What, what you fail to realize is that she's, she's, she's a man as well. Wait, so what would happen if I would have chose to do? Would I just never seen any of this? 
There's 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 a lot of stuff going on here. Oh, uh, hello. Hello. <laughs> what a coincidence. What a coincidence. <laughs> Um, so do you hate men? Men, 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 men? Yes, well... I hate them too. Honestly, why does such a species exist? They're all violent and inconsiderate and perverted and smelly and annoying. Nice to meet you. I'm Ayano Amamoto. Oh, uh, Ayana-san? Nice to meet you. My name is uh, Sweet Pea. What an interesting name. Are you a talented performer? Uh, yes, I suppose something like that. Is that so? You must be very troubled being followed around by gross otaku dudes, huh? Men are the worst, aren't they? Yes, they're filthy and greasy. Yes, yes, they're so disgusting. I can't stand being within 20 yards of them. That far away. Of course, even 200 yards. I can't stand it. It's so unpleasant. Well, I agree that their greasiness is unpleasant. Like when their faces shine. Or when the bridges of their glasses are all sticky. What the fuck? That, I used to wear glasses. That, I don't think that ever happened. Okay. Sometimes when they're eating ramen, the sweat and grease on their nose will cause their glasses to fall in the bowl. Yeah, I think you're speaking of personal problems, though, Sweet Pea. Oh my god, so gross. That's why they always have a handkerchief on them. A towel fabric one. A tower kerchief, is it? <laughs> yeah, that's it. Ah, uh, but, you know, they're all passengers on the spaceship called Earth, and they only take up a corner of the world. So maybe you should allow them to at least breathe in that little corner. No! What are you talking about? Guys get an overinflated ego because girls spot them like that. A lot of so Ooh, Pepsi! Yeah! Hey! Sexy tabs! Sexy bad tabs! Let's go! Oh, that's... Okay, that's Aria. <laughs> I was like to say, what the f That looked like a little katana. This <laughs> 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 sexy time. <laughs> <laughs> that was a super unnecessary cutscene, but I loved it. I loved. It. I just loved it. Just sexy tab. Sexy tab cutscene. This is a sexy tab episode. Yeah. yeah. Sexy tab. Anyway, I can't see them anymore. Sweet pizza. Have you been in the bath for too long? Oh no. You you should get out of the water. Oh uh, no. It's just. You're sweating a lot. Let's hurry and get out. Hey, look, we're all nude. Hey. Katana's got the best bod. 
How about this one? In this case, I have no choice. <gasps> She's about to go underwater. <laughs> you were looking straight at her. How did you not see? She obviously just went underwater. What? Huh? Where are you go? Are are you okay? Because <laughs> that, that's how we sound when we go underwater. We definitely make audible noises when we go underwater. Could she? Could she have drowned? This this writing is top notch right here. I love it. I love it so much. I love it so much. I'm not even gonna read it. Huh? Sexy bath time. Let's go. I love how in the cutscene we all had different boob sizes, but now now that we're all 3D and whatnot, our our boob sizes are all the same because they use the same model. Oh well. I like your necklace, Mifi. It's pretty cool. Oh, Shizuna has a necklace too, but you kind of got to look inside of her boob to see it. Or maybe that's not a necklace. Maybe that's just a random line. Or yeah, yeah, yeah. Okay, it's a ra it's a random it's a random line. Mifu is the only one with a necklace. I like your necklace, Mifu. I wish I had one like it. Sweet bae, where is she? <laughs> my ears. Ah, what are you doing my ears? What? Oh gosh, Shizuno, what the fuck's wrong? What the heck? Okay, calm, calm down. You miscreant? What's going on? Ink! Can we get another cutscene explaining what the fuck just went down? Anybody? Anybody? Just me? No? What's going on? Jeez. <laughs> Stork, where the fuck did these girls come from? And they're fully clothed! <laughs> look, look at that, they're wearing their school uniforms! <laughs> and look at this package! What? Why can we see the entire outline of his middle section? I don't like it. I don't like it. I'm, I'm, I'm barely confused about this entire thing. What's going on? He's stuck. What? What's the meaning of this? So he was peeping by pretending to be a statue. Sneaky. Oh, 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 oh. Wow. Did you call? Did anyone call? <laughs> Sweet Bee, I'm sure you're drowning down there. <laughs> ah, Sweet Pea son. Oh no. Be careful. She's a man on the inside. Ah, ah, shut up! Shut up! Shut up! What? No way. Is she really a he? That's the worst. The, the hell? You're a man? Why is a dude in the woman's bath? How dare you deceive me? What about you guys? Not once, but twice you stepped on the pure heart of this young maiden. This isn't a joke. I'm telling Mia. Is she running in water? What the fuck? Can she do that? Can anyone possibly do that? I guess this is a fake world, so like whatever. She ran out. Let the boys take care. Wait, let the boys take care of it. You over there, hurry up and go. Wait, you talking to her? Oh. <laughs> uh, hello there, you slender and beautiful young lady. You're just my type. Oh, he's bleeding through his little beak nostril. <laughs> I don't know what that would be called, but yeah, his beak nostril, he's bleeding. He's got a nose. Oh god, I don't like how they gave that close-up in his gooch. Uh, a man? That girl has a kaffa. Uh, 
Oh god. What is that? Ah! What is it? What is that? What kind of weapon is that? She electrocuted them? That's dope! That catharsis effect? Oh wow, that's like that's crazy. In one hit? This isn't good. Hey, you! Are you okay? Come on, wake up! suzuki chan get some cold water! Get some cold water. Okay. Yes! Where's Stark? Where's Stark? Uh, oh my god, he disappeared even after being electrocuted and fucked up in one shot. How long are you planning to sit there? Leave me alone. This chance is never coming again. <sighs> this is so an this is such an anime scene right now. This is this is so weird. They gotta like do it in every anime though, where like guys are like trying to peep in on the girls in the bathhouse. It's, it happens like every single anime. I know. So rude, so terrible. You're so mean. Hey! Hey! It's Sweet Pea! Ugh. After! Ugh. Ugh. She's naked! <laughs> this is kinda fucked up. <laughs> She's naked! She's a man! <laughs> oh god. This is funny. This is funny. Oh! Oh yeah! I forgot. Oh, is, is that so? There's too many voices right now. I'm, I'm getting like voice overload right now. I might start reading like normal voices or like just like my voice for a second. Just just so I can get caught back up. Damn, it's so heavy. Are you all right? Ah, oh, her weight's the same as in the real world. It doesn't look like y'all went anywhere. Yeah, come on, get up. We have to go after her. Hey, what is it this time? Ah, uh, Peeper, there's a pervert in here. Okay, okay, okay. Oh god, there weren't that many girls in there when we were just in there. Ah, uh, uh, no, oh god, everybody got trapped. What are you guys doing? I don't know if it's worth asking, but about. I don't know if it's worth asking about. Yeah, whatever. Talk. What words? I didn't think she'd be one of us too. Sorry, we lost her. She's crazy fast. Is this the girl you were talking about on wire? The one with the same power as you guys? Yes, now that everyone's here, let's share the information we've gathered. So, that Stark guy. He must have mimicked a female customer and hidden the ensuing chaos to escape. He imitated the statue to boldly peep into the woman's bath, then stomped all over us to escape. I won't forgive him. I'll never forgive him. It's pretty obvious that you're envious. Disappointing. Even the scary cat. That's pretty bad. But this isn't good. Sweet Pea Sun and Peeper Sun both got away from us. No, that pervert's probably in this facility somewhere. Kinsuke King, if there was a woman's bath where you could peep as much as you wanted, would you throw that chance away to escape? Uh, of course not. What a perf. Maybe the Stark is masquerading as Kinsuke King. Don't be stupid. I'm just saying that if, 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 if
I was Stork, then, then no, I'm not Stork. Well, that's your opinion, Kinsuke. Yeah, pervert. Yeah, yeah, hentai. A perv. Me moonshine. Why did you call me that? <laughs> Whoa! The Go Home Club intruding on a gentleman's secrets. I'll never forgive you. Find me if you can. I'll make you search forever. See? Ew, grass! I get it now. This song might sound like a sweet love ballad, but it's actually him claiming responsibility for criminal acts. He says really smooth sounding things like, I'll always be watching over you, but they're all sleazy songs about peeping and looking at vaginas. I see. Uh, criminal is best at uh, understanding the psychology of criminals, and a pervert is best at understanding the psychology of a pervert. Yeah, whatever. Yeah, great anime lines. Move on. This is awesome. Freaking guys. Yep. Hey. Let's go find Stalk. We can't allow any more victims like this guy. Yeah, but what's the deal about it? If we let her roam free, there might be a casualty. Even so, if we let her in the go home club, don't you think we might get killed? Her hatred of men is extremely abnormal. Us girls will try to persuade her. Just give us some time. Hey, what's up? Come on, Ayana. Introduce yourself to everyone. There's one perf, but he's harmless. You forget the one that's watching from behind his computer screen. <laughs> Maybe the biggest perv there is, and his name is Lucid, the mysterious Oshinato musician. <laughs> Uh, um, I'm Ayano Amamoto. I'm very sorry about earlier. I don't want to live in this world anymore, so... Please allow me to join the Go Home Club? Uh... Don't kill the middle members, alright? I'm sorry, it's just when there's a boy in your mind. I can't control myself, so I'll try my best, I guess. Jeez, President, you didn't have to say that. Well, it's like a thing we probably gotta worry about. You can't be like headbutting Shogo, even though he does deserve it, after headbutting me in the first episode and in the opening credits again. You saw that. There might be a reason why. I feel bad for her. You have no subtlety. Okay, don't you, don't everybody crack on what I said. Does everybody have to respond? I don't think everybody, every single person has to say something to that. Hey, that's enough. We're all so scared. So think of how we also feel. Well then, let's give it to that pervert and force him to tell us Miyu's location. He's probably mimicking something and peeping at us from somewhere. Just attack anything that looks suspicious and comb the area. Ayana is a debuff specialist who excels at administering stun status effects. Dope. So she, just, so she like electrocutes people. Cast status effects to put the enemy at a disadvantage and halt the enemy's actions. That's cool. Hey, what's going on, everybody? How's it going? It's already so dangerous, but at least another catharsis effect's been awakened. Watch your backs, everyone. Jeez, women are scary. Stork must have wished for mimicry power from me, much like how I obtained the power to compose music. His peeping obsession is quite alarming. Let's see. 
Oh wow, the activity of the Go Home Club is so interesting. I don't know if I want to go home now. I love how her and uh, Mifu just become friends because like I sort of gave them similar voices. So that's that's kind of interesting. That like I sense the similarities between them two as well. Anyway. Are you serious, Naruko? You learned about Astral Syndrome, didn't you? You can't just stay here forever. I'm just kidding. I want to have fun, so... I'm, I was having fun, so... Okay. President, Kinsuke Kid is lit, isn't he? Though he looks very dangerous, serious, people aren't necessarily as they seem. It's not good for strengthening your battle power, Ayano-chan, but you seem to have your reason, so just don't overdo it. A uh, paper that can change into anything is frightening. Can we really find him? <laughs> I'm so glad the president is a girl. All of the girls are so nice. On the other hand, the boys, they all seem quite dangerous. I'm surprised you can be around them. Okay, you weirdo. Let's see, anybody else? Another weird one's joined our group. Everyone here besides me is a weirdo. <laughs> that sounds like a pot calling the Kettle Black Station. What? I don't understand that reference, but oh well, we'll let you have that one, Aria. Anyway, it's gonna be with Saka. <coughs> He's probably the main reason why I gotta stop. I, I keep forgetting what his voice is. <laughs> He's the main reason why like, I always pause in the middle of these fucking sentences. So, wait. Uh, will I also get this catharsis effect? A uh, catharsis effect is the explosive relief of what's hidden inside your soul. I'm sure you have it too, AG. Hey, Call it truth and facade, interior and exterior, ego and Subconscious, but there are no humans alive who aren't hiding something within, right? Hmm. You seem to have strong self control, AG, so it'll probably be hard for it to come out. Giggity. I see. By the way, can you kill someone with this power? It's not physical, so it's impossible. It's Kind of like giving someone a spiritual shock with the cry of your soul. That sounds like some good jazz music right there. A spiritual shock with the cry of your soul. That sounds like my next album cover. That's why Digiheads don't die and just return to sanity after their brainwashing melts away. I see. Is that so? So she's not that scary, is she? Thank you, Arya. That really helped me understand. Alright, let's get it. Let's get, get, get it. Let's, uh, put our new cast member. Ayano! Ayana! That's her name, Ayana. She doesn't, doesn't look too badass, but, you know, it's alright. It's alright. Stun gun. Okay, let's add her to the party. Why don't we? We'll trade her out for, uh, I think Katono is the most... She's the most effective member, so I'm gonna keep her in. And I'm still like learning like Kinsuke, so I'm gonna keep him in there. There's gonna be me, Blaze Black, Kinsuke, Hibiki, and Katona. Dope, I'm ready. I'm ready, how about you? Are you ready for the next episode? Oh, ho, 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 gonna end it right now because it's been an hour and 50 minutes, two hours almost, and it's time for me to go to bitty bitty bed. So I'm gonna end it right here, and we'll 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 leave off Stork for the next episode of this, the Caligula effect. Whenever it happens, we got a new member, so that's cool. And you know, Kinsuke's a perv. That's that's what we know. And you know, she hates men. And Katona. I don't know what about Katona, but she's there's something weird about her. I know. We're we're gonna find out something crazy and super revealing about Katona. I just know it. I know it in my heart. She's too she's too perfect. Not to have something seriously wrong with her. You know what I'm saying? You know what I mean? There's something wrong with like the rest of the characters except for Katona. So we gotta we gotta find out what's wrong with her. Okay? I got my own you, Katona. You better not do something weird.
or lucid, that mystery musician will come for you. And it's definitely not me. I'm definitely not lucid, the mysterious musician. But anyway. I have been your lovely host, Makai Vega. This has been the Kid Liggy Love Fact Overdose. Remember, YouTube can be here if you subscribe every day. Leave me a tip to comments from you in the comment section down below. Until next time, I'll see you Peace.